subscribe to our channel, and hit the bell icon, to never miss a video from us. Hi! Welcome to Test Prep Training. Today we will discuss about, SAP Certified Application Associate, Certification. This exam verifies, that the candidate possesses fundamental knowledge, and proven skills, in the area of SAP, S4, HANA, Financial Accounting, Learning Objectives. The objectives for the exam, is as follows. 1. Financial Closing. 2. General Ledger Accounting. 3. Accounts Payable, and Accounts Receivable. 4. Asset Accounting. 5. SAP Financials Cross Topics. 6. SAP, HANA, SAP, S4, HANA, and SAP Fury, Learning Path. SAP offers 150 plus various certifications, that are available in up to 9 languages, to suffice the needs of learners, across the entire organization. Three different certification types are offered. 1. Associate Certification. 2. Specialist Certification. 3. Professional Certification. The C, D, S, 4 F I, 1809, SAP Certified Application Associate, SAP, S4, HANA, for Financial Accounting Associates, is an associate level certification. Exam details. 1. Exam name is SAP, S4, HANA, for Financial Accounting Associates, SAP, S4, HANA, 1809. 2. Exam code is C, D, S, 4 F I, 1809. 3. Number of questions are 80. 4. Length of time is 180 minutes. 5. Passing score is 63%. 6. Languages are German, English, Spanish, French, Japanese, Korean, Russian, and Chinese. How to register for the exam? To register for the exam, follow the below mentioned steps. 1. Go to registers, or log in. 2. Select the certification you want to buy, and add that to the basket. 3. Purchase the exam by making payment, and then you will also get access to the Learning Hub. 4. When you go to the Learning Hub, it will show a dashboard, with your purchased exam, and status. You can schedule your exam here. Now, we will discuss about course outline. Domain 1, Financial Closing, which comprises of 12% weightage in exam. This perform month, and year end closing, in financial accounting, exchange rate valuation, post provisions etc., create a balance sheet, create profit, and loss statements, monitor closing operations, using the financial closing cockpit, post accruals with accrual documents, and recurring entry documents, and manage posting periods. Domain 2, General Ledger Accounting, which comprises of 12% weightage in exam. This create, and maintain general ledger accounts, exchange rates, bank master data, and define house banks create, and reverse general ledger transfer postings, post cross-company code transactions, create profit centers, and segments. Clear an account, and define, and use a chart of accounts. Maintain tolerances, tax codes, and post documents with document splitting. Domain 3, Accounts Payable, and Accounts Receivable, which comprises of 12% weightage in exam. This create, and maintain business partners, post invoices, and payments, and use special G. L transactions, reverse invoices, and payments, block open invoices for payment, configure the payment program, and manage partial payments. Define the customizing settings for the payment medium workbench, use the debit balance check for handling payments, define terms of payment, and payment types, explain the connection of customers, to vendors, describe integration, with procurement, and sales. Domain 4, Asset Accounting, which comprises of 12% weightage in exam, this create, and maintain charts of depreciation, and the depreciation areas, asset classes, asset master data, and configure, and perform FI, A, A, business processes in the SAP system. Set up valuation, and depreciation, perform periodic, and year-end closing processes, and explain, and configure parallel accounting. Domain 5, SAP Financials Cross Topics, which comprises of 12% weightage in exam, this manage organizational units, currencies, configure validations, and document types, utilize reporting tools, configure substitutions, and manage number ranges. Domain 6, SAP, HANA, SAP, S4, HANA, and SAP Fiori, which comprises of 8% to 12% weightage in exam. 
This explain the SAP HANA architecture and describe the SAP S4 HANA scope and deployment options. Exam policies. The candidate should visit the official page of SAP terms and conditions, privacy policies, etc. The terms and conditions for SAP include the SAP education definitions and interpretations, basis of orders, registration, and dates, download, and access to online training, price, and payment, prerequisites, etc. Reschedule policy. SAP has an exam reschedule policy, in which candidates can reschedule an exam in Certification Hub, by using the calendar icon in the exam appointments, or upcoming appointments section. However, they must cancel, or reschedule the exam at least 24 hours before the scheduled appointment date and time. Retake policy. Candidates can take the exam up to three times. For those candidates who do not pass an exam after three attempts, then they will need to re-register for the next release of the exam. And if you do not pass the next release after three attempts, then you will not be able to retake the exam until the next edition is released, which is within one year. Now we will discuss about preparatory guide. One. SAP Official Website Visiting the SAP Official Website is an imperative step while preparing for the exam. The official site gives a lot of information and sources which is very valuable in preparing for the exam. The resources such as study guide, courses, training programs, sample papers, white papers, documentation, facts, etc. 2. SAP Instructor-led training courses The candidate can also opt for the SAP training programs the SAP offers training programs on every exam. The instructor-led training programs for a particular exam contain all information of the exam, such as description, intended audience, delivery method, duration, etc. 3. Self-paced training. SAP provides self-paced training that offers candidates a wide range of learning styles and subject matter requirements. This training helps project team members, support professionals, end users, and power users to meet their needs that are accessible from anywhere. 4. SAP Learning Hub SAP gives candidates access to learning hubs to help them in building and maintaining their skills with self-paced digital learning content that includes e-books, expert-led social learning forums, access to pre-configured training systems for real-world practice. 5. Join a study group Joining a group study will also be beneficial for the candidate. It will encourage them to do more hard work. Also, studying in the group will help them to stay connected with the other people who are on the same pathway as them. Also, the discussion of such study groups will benefit the students in their exam. 6. Practice test. Practice tests are the one who ensures the candidate about their preparation. The practice test will help the candidates to acknowledge their weak areas so that they can work on them. There are many practice tests available on the internet nowadays, so the candidate can choose which they want. For more such videos, subscribe to our channel.